the smallest integer that can be represented by an 8 bit number whose complement form is 8. Now, we all know that for an n bit number, the range of this complement number system ranges from minus 2 raised to n minus 1 to 2 raised to n minus 1 minus 1. Simply substituting the value as 8 in the case of n, we get the smallest value as 128 minus 128 is the answer. However, what if you are not sure that you made a mistake? In such cases, it's helpful to derive the entire formula for the complement complement in less than 30 seconds. I'll tell you the trick how to actually go about doing it. Now, to make it easy, I'm going to scale down this 8-bit number into a 3-bit number. Now, in a 3-bit number system, the numbers range from 0, 0, 0 to 1, 1, 1. Now, since we talked about 1's complement and 3's complement representation, the last bit or the NSB, the most significant bit, is always reserved as the sign bit. Hence, in 1's complement representation, what we do is the numbers range from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, well, not 4. This time it becomes minus 3. Why? Because it's reserved as sine, and this is actually 1's complement. Because 1's complement is actually in such integers of 1's, 1's, 0, and so on. And similarly, this is nothing but minus 2, minus 1, and minus 0. Yes, it is minus 0. So, as you can see, 0 and minus 0 is redundant because there is no such thing as a minus 0. Hence, to avoid that issue, there was the need for truth complement representation where the numbers range the same way in positive sense, but for the negative numbers, minus 0 is replaced by minus 1, minus 2, minus 3, and minus 4. Hence, the range of truth complement number is one more than the range of one's complement number. Hence, for a 3-bit truth complement number, the number or the value ranges from minus 4 to 3. If I want to try to generalize it, I can write it as this. And for n bit, this would be the formula. This is how we get the range for an n-bit 